Shoo! How's it going, folks? Welcome back. We are at the farm. We're starting it off at the farm. This is like this is the good old days. You guys remember? The old Flare B&B 2.0. Yes, she's still here. Wow, this area looks like it's in shambles. We should probably pick some of the stuff up. I feel like it probably shouldn't be just laying everywhere. What is it? In all What's in all this stuff? We got boxes everywhere, bonds. We just left it a mess. We left it. Kind of like your life. It's kind of like my life. It's kind of like a mess. But I have not stepped foot in this thing in like three months since I basically moved to my house. Have not stepped foot, so we're gonna see if there's any raccoons. You got a gun? You strapped? Good. All right. Any raccoons in here or mouse poop? So far, so good. Wow, it's actually kind of warm in here. Perfect. We still have oil from four months ago that we can fry something in tonight. We gotta come check on, check on the old B and B. And the fridge still works. Yep. Anyone want some? Pota you guys want some potato salad? Ooh, ooh. You, oh. Gross. Ooh, you smell that? John, we got broccoli with cheese sauce for you. Yep, we got a slamming. We're slamming. We need him to come clean all this stuff up. We should get this thing up and running, though. Oh, I forgot I had I feel that. like this is how you need to clean your chicken coop. Oh, true. Gas mask action. Yeah. Yeah, because no one likes salmon vanilla, so you put that thing on and go tend to the chickens. Yep. Let's yeah, I think that is, that is a good idea. Yeah, would you guys want to see some camping vlogs? I mean, like, we could come down here when we're hunting. You know, deer hunting or duck hunting and, and like maybe stay the night. That way we're like, you know, 30 minutes closer to the farm than my house. But I don't know. We had to, we had to make sure our life wasn't quite in shambles. Oh, we got gum. They, oh, these are all my tools went. God, I've been looking for all those. I bought all those tools. Yeah, I couldn't find them in my house. They're all here, not getting used. I even bought this nice TV that we've literally never turned on. Anyways, that's the camper. If you guys are new to the channel, that's the Flare B&B 2.0. <sighs> Look how cold it is. Freaking freezing. It is so freaking cold out here. Bonzo, there's ducks right there. I see some ducks. Oh, Black there's more. Oh, there's more. There's more over there. Black mallards. Oh God, yeah. Oh, those are some coots. Should we shoot some coots, Bonzo? Bonzo, you ever shot a coot? I don't know. I don't know if I've ever shot a coot. I've never shot a coot. The limit for coots is 15, so maybe we could go hard. Are there actual any other ducks flying? I, we want to figure that out before we start shooting. We know we came down here with not really an agenda other than, you know, to film a farm vlog. And uh, I see a bunch of coots. They're hey, starting to swim. Send it. That's your that's your send that's, it sticker. That's your send it sticker. Oh, that is my gun. Did you clean it for me? I did. No, let's see it. Let's hear it. Ooh, shoo, it she was, sounds this nice. It was orange. Well, was whose fault rust. was that? You. That's true. I I left it. I put it in wet in the gun case. And Bonzo cleaned it up for me. So we are we are good to go. But I think we should go shoot some moves. Before we do that, you might notice the hoodie I'm wearing and the hat I'm wearing. This is old school and this is bottomless. If you guys want either item or a bunch of other duck hunting stuff, we got vests, we've got calls, we've got lanyards, we've got send it stickers. If you guys like send it stickers, we got a whole bunch of other stuff. It'll be linked down below if you guys want to go check it out. But so these bottom line hoodies, fresh in stock and same thing with these hats. Get them while they're here. Once they're gone, they're gone. There's no restock in here. Once they're gone, they're gone. I said we go shoot some coots. Start off the farm vlog with the bang. You guys stay tuned. We're loading up boys. Bonzo's convinced me that this is a good idea. I mean, honestly, who's, is anyone eating? No one's eating them here. No one's hunted or eating them. And the thing about the, the coot is like, it's the carp of the sky. In the fishing world, carp, think about a carp. It doesn't taste too good. That's what I've been told is, uh, is the deal with these guys. So I'm just gonna go ahead and throw some shells in my pocket, shells in the gun here. We're gonna see if we can go find something. You see any? I thought there were some in this slough here, no? They, they flew away. Turn that. Well, let's look at that one. I don't see any. We blew our cover. All right, new strap. Walk back that way. Well, we suck. We're gonna we're gonna keep scouting. We're gonna actually. We decided we convinced ourselves we're gonna go duck hunt tonight. This is my first time doing an evening hunt in the farm. We've only been doing the morning sends, which are nice, but you kind of get tired. It's like what two, three, four, three o'clock. So we got two. Hours. two by the time we get set up, we're gonna have a little less than two hours of shooting time. We're gonna actually head back, grab the tank, grab some decoys, put on some waders, and kill some coots and maybe some mallards. You guys stay tuned. Filming? Yep. Guns are I got one. You got one? Yeah, I got one. We literally just pulled up to our spot and there's coos, so Bonzo jumped out. I shot and then he shot. He got one. My gun's broken though, so it'll be a one shot, one kill kind of day, I guess. When you're a sniper, it don't even matter. 
I've never shot one of these before. Andrew told me the mission today was to shoot a coot, so that's what I did. I'm here for him. I'm gonna do something with this thing. I don't know what yet, though. Let's kill some ducks. All right, got everything ready. Like I said, I'll be doing the one shot challenge. Gun's broken, don't know what happened. But uh, we need to park the tank and we got some decoy. We only, we only threw out like a dozen decoys, a couple flashers. I think we'll be good. No wind though, so we gotta be extra quiet. One down. You know it's a good sign when the first bird is a Drake Mallard. Straight up freaking beauty. Look at that double curl. Beauty. We just got started. Coming back. Coming back. Coming back. You got him. One shot, one kill out here, boys. You know, you gotta run with the punches. Broken gun, no problem. Just make the one shot count. Oh, bunch on the left, Bonzo. Bunch on the left. <laughs> oh yeah, it's all yours. You shoot that bird, Bonzo. Oh, 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 you got him down. That's an old gaddy down for the count. That is number three. I've got little Drake. I'm thinking about mounting it, Johnny. What do you think? He's a good looking one. He's got two curls. Two curls for the girls. I'm thinking about mounting him. But we got two gaddies. I got a gaddy, Bonzer just got a gaddy, and a coot, and I've got a drake. So far it's working out, no wind whatsoever, we're literally in this random, oh, oh. Oh, they're, they're, gonna, they're gonna come back here in a second, but we're literally just in this random hole. As terrible as the flood was this spring, the duck hunting is unreal, boys. There's so much to hunt around here, it's crazy, so much. Oh, Bonzo, these are dumping, boys. <laughs> but only having one shot. What? Oh, what's going on? Bonzo, what's the strat? I know. They're a little far from me. Why don't I scoot up a bit? We're going we're going with the crouch tactic. Oh, there's one right here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, I got one. That's number three for me, boys. That was another gaddy. Well, so far, like I said, I'm having to take these very precise shots. Take my time. Make sure I don't miss. I don't have a second shot. But uh, we're racking up the score now. Got three. Bonzo, you got one. And then a cootie. Bonzo's a big cootie guy. All right, next one that's in your in your range, Bonzo. You kill that sucker. <laughs> Shoot him! I missed. I only got one shell, boys. Oh, you got one, Bonzo. Oh, that one wrecked. This gun just decides to work sometimes, occasionally. I missed, Bonzo got him. That's two for Bonzo. That group did it decent. They're a little far, but not, not terribly far. Maybe my gun will start working now. Oh yeah. Gaddy alert. Slowly but surely, they're coming in. How much time have we been hunting? We've been shooting for 30 minutes out here. We already got five ducks down. Probably could've killed a lot more. Get back in the tree so they don't see us. <laughs> Kill that one, Bonzo. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, you got him with the third shot. <laughs> that was on Bonzo's side. Third time's a charm, right? Well, Bonzo's gonna go retrieve the one that landed in a tree, apparently. I'm gonna stay here and hold down the fort. It's 3-3. Three, three. Bonzo and I both got three. We both have three to go. And uh, like I said, gun's working now, so we're good. Like, we're, ready to, we're ready to spray and pry, baby. Woo there we go. There's one. Finally, I'm up to four. There you go. Little green weaning action. That's number four for me. I got two to go. Bonzo's got three. We got about 45 minutes left, so we better get to shoot. 
Kill him. Ow! Almost caught him. Another green wang. Finds us five. I'm behind him. We got one to go, boys. <laughs> right here. Kill him. Yeah, Bonza got one. Yeah, I killed him. Right there, dead. Look at this. Look at this jam ski going on here. What's this strat? Just absolutely toast. Uh oh, Bonza, we got one coming in. I'm out of commission, Bonza. This is all you. <laughs> Kill him. Yes, sir. Yeah, limit it out. Get him, Bonza. Come on. Kill that bird. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> There you have it, folks. How many you got left, Bonzo? I got one left. I got five ducks. You got off. five down. I'm I'm done. This is a Bonzo spectating show. And uh, this gun, you know, when you're supposed to push this button, it's supposed to do something. That button's also supposed to do something, and that's not moving. So uh, worked out good that I limited out when my gun literally just completely fell apart. Anyways, Bonzo's got one left, and we're out of here, boys. Shoot, <laughs> oh, he got no shoot that one. <laughs> I'm not going to. But look how shoot, close it was. They were so close. That's it. That's the old limit now, boys. What time? What time? We get time check. How long did that take us? I would say less than an hour. Time's 4:42. 4:42. Oh, we got 30 minutes for John to shoot his six. Should John, John, John you want to kill some oh birds? Oh God, yeah. Wow. We actually limited out with enough time. With enough time for Johnny to shoot. Got a few minutes left before sun sunset. As you can see, the sun's not set, so that means you can keep shooting. John's got the got the old boom pole the the working boom pole not the yeah. broken boom pole the send it stick we sent it too hard on the send it stick it just it broke so we gotta put the send it stick back in the shop but johnny's up Let's see if we can clap a couple birds here before we head in and do a little coot catch and cook shout out to bonzo for killing one yep i didn't kill it i got you i don't think i think i missed mine but bonzo got one boom there it is folks <laughs> give that a whiff bonzo tell me what that smells like bring back any memories Mm, smells like ass, okay? That's what it smells like. It smells absolutely terrible. This We didn't show the cleaning process because YouTube's been freaking out lately with blood, but I promise this is, in fact, cool. It actually had, like, can you see this white fat right there? It had this all over it. I've never seen anything like it. I really wanted to show you guys, but I just I can't show it to you. So I thought they had more meat. I thought they did, too. The, I mean, this looks, like, smaller than teal. But uh, what we're going to do, we, we are here in the camper. By the way, we didn't go back home. And uh, we actually turned the heat on for the first time. It's nice in here. We should start singing here more often. But we've got the old fryer getting ready right there. Look at all that boiling going on. And of course, y'all already know the sauce. And we've got flour. And we're going to do a little fry action. I'd probably cut these up a little bit. we got we got a key knife laying around here. Bonzo, what are you thinking? Half these? I was thinking fours. What do you think? Oof, whoa. Four, you'd be, you want to do like real small? You want to be able to somewhat taste it, kind of. No, you don't. Yeah, see, that's fours. Thirds? I'd do that. Thirds? Yeah, I gotta get some we gotta get some chunk daddy. I just wanna make sure there's enough pieces for John to taste. Yeah, it. true. We gotta make sure there's enough for John. There you go. Oh yeah. Perfect. Get a little drink in it. We're gonna let those sit there for a minute. Looks like the fry's about ready. We got just a little bit of sauce. Not a whole lot, but enough to hopefully do the job for the day. Anyone wanna take guesses? Is this gonna be the worst thing we've eaten on the channel? Or do you think do you think possum will take the cake? You think possum's gonna be worse than this? No, nah, it's gonna taste gonna like gizzards. Worse. It's gonna taste it's like gonna fried taste gizzards. Alright, get these out here to dry. Perfect. These are all nice and dried. That way the uh, batter sticks decent. And actually, I think I'm gonna go with a little little flour toss prior to the Frank dousing. It'll help it stick a little bit better and get the get the coating on it a little bit better. Well, this is really gonna taste terrible, boys. I can already tell. Good old flour action. So you don't need a nice kitchen. Solo cups will do anything that you want in life. It'll get the job done for you. All right, give these a little tossy toss. This is how, this is how professionals do Why don't you do. put this the other way? Because it's like a, what do you call that? A, yeah, you don't know the name of that. It's a, it starts with an M. What is it? M M martini. Oh, <laughs> dang. Yeah, boy. It's a martini. It's like. All right, now that it's covered, throw it in the Franks, just like that. So we don't have a whole lot of Franks. It should be just enough for what we're trying to do here. Perfect. All right. These things are a little mix in here. All right, give it a little twisty. See, there you go. Boom! They look like little buffalo wings. Then you throw them back in the flour. Give them the old whirly twirly again, just like that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right. Yep. Pull her out. 
Yeah. Yes, sir. Coming in hot. She. Bombs out. Yes, sir. Give her the old dunk ski. She. Don't overcook these. Don't overcook them. Once they start floating, you take them out. Oh, yeah. She's a floating, boys. Don't burn me. Ooh. All right. Let them cook through and cool off a little bit. Give them the old taste test. Boom. So it's a season salt, yep. little season salt action, right? We'll come out of the fryer when they're wet and it dries and kind of cures onto it. But oh, we really need to clean this camper. It's kind of in shambles. I kind of, I like the vibe though. You know, we need to use this more. I, I feel like we're in uh we're in hunting country. Like you come when you go back home and it's just not a nice house. Like yeah, I don't know, man. This is it's roughing like it. Duck a little. camp, you know. It's like duck camp. It's not roughing it, but it's like duck camp where you got the got the heater going. How's this feeling? It feels great. Oh god, it feels good. I can feel my feet. Yeah, I can feel my toes now. We got TV. I feel like we need to start camping in here. If you guys want to see that, whether it's deer hunting, duck hunting, you know, whether we come back after an evening hunt, sleep here and hunt the next morning, uh, or just come down here and do a little camping. If you guys want to see it, let us know. Kind of, I kind of like the vibe. It feels like duck camp out here. Stick this meat in your mouth, Bonzo. Pulling apple feet. I did shoot it, so I'm gonna take the biggest piece since I did shoot it. Oh God, he went in for it. It's gotta be hot, bro, no? Surprised me with a, oh wow. Is Dang. it that? Is it that bad? I don't know, it's not like it's bad. It just has a distinct taste. It means it's bad. Oh, that's gross, bro. Do you think so? Oh yeah. It tastes exactly the way you would think it would taste. It tastes a little better than I thought. Take another piece. Maybe you got a bad piece. Maybe I got a bad piece. It tasted like the smell of coot. No? This piece is way worse. Ooh. Okay, I got a bad piece then. No, I got a good piece. Ooh. That, that, piece, for... that piece was better. Ooh, this one tastes really strong. Two pieces it left. It just tastes... John, you have to. John, you have to. No, dude, you're doing it. Bro. The meat is black. Bro, it looks it's just like meat. everything else. You're hyping it up. No, I can't. That was gross. That was nasty, dude. You didn't even taste yeah, it. Yeah, I got a little bite and I tasted so much game and like so much nastiness. I said, no, it's, I can't. It wasn't that off. It's pretty bad. It was It was exactly what I thought. Like just the gamiest. I still think we covered up the taste a little bit. We did. I don't think you could make it taste any better than that. I mean, that was about as intense as you could I get mean, with the flavoring. I ate three pieces, so I'm pretty hungry though. <sighs> Bonzo, you can't be the judge. Everyone's gonna discredit your judgment. But, but you, it's still you, edible. No, it's, he, he doesn't think it's no, edible. No, it's, it's edible. It's just, God, dude, it is it is exactly what you thought. Like, you take a bite and it is game, nasty game, swampy I tasted, game. I tasted some mud. It tasted like booty hole, all right? It tasted exactly the way I thought it would taste. Shoo! If you guys ever kill, caught, clean, cook, get coot, and uh, you got a better recipe, let me know. Not that I want to go shoot that ever again. Thanks, Bonza, for killing one. I was kind of hoping I wouldn't kill one. You're and welcome. then we could just made a, you know, a little widgeon catch clean cook or something like that. But hope you guys enjoyed today's episode of Being Bonzo. Hit the limit. If you guys enjoy the video, just a quick little evening sesh. Nothing too crazy. Normally, I mean, this is the first time, this is the first time in my entire life I've ever limited out on birds in the evening. Ever, ever, ever. I never hunt in the evening. Ever. Especially on the water. Sometimes I do feel hunt. And uh, honestly, it was one of the greatest things I've ever done. Because it was like, you're not tired. You're well fed you've you know you had you had lunch a big lunch and you get out here and it's warm and it's sunny and you kill birds and you get back before dark and uh, it was a good time so if you enjoyed the evening hunt let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below and remember this hoodie the old bottom land this vest this hat the call i was using the lanyard i was wearing the socks i'm wearing the pants i'm wearing the everything i'm wearing is all gonna be linked down below if you guys want to go check it out if you're a duck hunter or you like warm swag or you like duck swag or you just like swag in general and you want to hook up on the dopest merch in the game it'll be linked down below go to duckswaterfile.com thank you guys so much for watching and peace